Hello everyone, my name is DevScripted, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make this locked door in Roblox Studios. So if I click it without a key, it does not work. But if I come over here, pick up this key, now if I try to open it, it does. This is a follow up to my last video, so if you haven't watched it, go check it out. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so first thing we need to do is make this key. Head over to workspace and add a model. Make sure to name it. I'm going to name it key pickup. Now we have to get the key. You can make one yourself or you can head over to the toolbox like I'm doing here. I'm going to be using this one. I'm going to go ahead and name it key and then I'm going to put it in the model. Now put a proximity prompt in the key. Now type key in objective text and pick up key in action text. You can go ahead and mess around with these settings if you'd like, but I'm not going to. Now let's go ahead and make the tool. In workspace, add a tool and name it key tool. Now instead of part, this is going to be the handle. So make it as small as possible. I'm going to go ahead and make the tool. Once you're done, you should have something like this. Make sure the key is under the handle and connect them using a weld constraint. Now put the key tool in replicated storage. Go back to the key model and put a script under the proximity prompt. Now copy this exact code. Now we are done with the script, so we can go ahead and test it. So if I walk up to it, proximity prompt shows up, and if I press E, it goes into my inventory. Wait, I just need to make the handle transparent and we're good. Okay, so now that we're done with the key, we can go ahead and start on the door. I'm going to be using the same door model from my last video, so if you haven't watched it, go check it out. Control D, bring it over here, I'm going to rename it to key door model, and I'm going to look up lock, uh, let's see, uh, this one looks good, now I'm going to go ahead and make the model. Make sure to attach the lock to the door using a weld constraint. Once you're done, go to replicated storage and put in a remote event and name it unlock door. Now go to the model and insert a script and type this code.
Now that we're done with this script, create a local script in either key tool or in starter player scripts. I'm going to put it in key tool. Now copy this exact code. Now that we're done with the script, we can test it. Now, if I go to the door and click on it without the key, it doesn't open. And if I go ahead and grab the key and click it, it'll open. And that lock is floating. I think it's anchored. All right, so now if I test it out, it should work. And boom. And that's how you create a locked door system in Roblox Studio. If you found this video helpful, give it a like and subscribe.
and let me know in the comments what I should make a tutorial on next. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.